Good evening, everyone. It's a sight that would likely send you in the other directions very fast. A shark fin making its way around you in waist deep water. Swimmers made a rush to the shoreline, narrowly escaping any close contact. After the initial frenzy, though, many of them ran back to get a good look and get some video of the sharks. Channel 4's Haley Winslow talked to some of those who were there on Jacksonville Beach. This is about where the two sharks were. We're told they were about six foot bull sharks. It was quite a spectacle for everybody on the beach on their first day of spring break. We know one of the sharks was so close to the fishing pier because a fisherman caught the shark and then released it right where there were a lot of people swimming and surfing. We looked back on our statistics and there were two people bit by a shark in our waters last year, three the year before, and it's been about the same trend since 2010. The last time somebody was killed by a shark in Florida, was down south in Stewart. That was a kite boarder who was uh, surrounded and attacked by several sharks. The last fatality involving a bull shark was in 2010. That was a man in New Jersey. And then a teenage girl was killed by a bull shark in the Gulf in 2005. Pretty big sight here as hundreds of people went into the water, looked at the shark, and then the shark swam away. Uh, the other one was seen right under the fishing pier slashing its tail. Now, I did talk to some lifeguards a few minutes ago. They said they've pulled about a half a dozen people from the water today because of rip current. So those are also a problem. The weather is supposed to be nice tomorrow. So if you plan on coming to Jacksonville Beach, be careful. Reporting from Jacksonville Beach, Haley Winslow, Channel 4, the local station.